hello again same day like just like same day shipping today I, that was a stupid joke today i will be going over a razor build guide because i can yeah that's my only reason also he's my favorite four star character Uh, so, this build guide is obviously for, well, Razor. The weapon I recommend, if you're free to play, is the Prototype Archaic. It's a fairly good weapon. It's pretty, it's attack percent, which is important for high damage, and, or crit rate and crit damage. And it has a pretty high base attack, along with its passive, but if you have a bit more luck, Wolves Grace Zone is a great option for you. It's a very powerful weapon with very strong stacks that boost your attack. And as for artifacts, two-piece Pale Flame, two-piece Bloodstain, I recommend a Electro. Damage Goblet instead of Physical, because, well, that's how I use him, as a hybrid character, between Electro and Physical. Uh, crit Rate, or Crit Damage Mask, if you're going to use any of the weapons I recommended. Uh, crit Rate is normally harder to obtain. I think he just barely reaches, like, 49. Attack Percent Sands, and that's it. Or four piece gladiators finale. I don't know why this works. It just does. It it works. I don't that's just what I know. Team composition bit different. The the fourth slot is whoever you want. I have it filled with Raiden. You could also use Lisa, but it's just for that extra energy recharge. Because Razor's burst is very special, but uh Kaya, for free to play. Kaya, his burst allows swirling icicles, especially at C6 when he has 4, but that's really expensive. But, uh, C S any constellation will do. Uh, energy recharge sword, like sacrificial, will work unless you're using Jingxiao for electrocharged or something. Or if you have 2, you could also do that. But, it's very good for Kaya because it allows Superconduct, which lowers physical resistance, which will allow Razor to do more damage very quickly because he is more of a physical DPS than an Electro. And a more premium option is Chi Chi because, well, her healing orb thing that swirls, it also applies Cryo, which will work for Superconduct. Again, sacrificial, but I think Skyward also works well for her. Along with just a healing build, or maybe two-piece uh, Blizzard Strayer and two-piece... It's either going to be two-piece Ocean Hues slash uh, Maiden's Beloved, or two-piece Blizzard, two-piece Gladiator, or any attack set and uh because i use him as a electro physical hybrid sucrose will also work quite well because she can swirl electro lowering the f the electro resistance and or you could use animal traveler to basically the same effect it won't be as defective but it's not bad to have Animo Traveler built. Especially if you're going to be using an Animo main TBS anyway. Animo Traveler is great. But that is my full build guide for, uh, well, Razor. I will do a boss build guide for Razor as well because, well, I love Razor. He's probably one of my favorite four stars. My favorite five star being Raiden. But since that's all for this video, I might make another. I will see you later.